You know what? You know what? I just realized something. Marina's life bar doesn't fully show when I have the TV on that uh, expand sort of thing, so I'm gonna leave it just like this. It's just fine, and it, and it doesn't look as... I shouldn't say stretch. Well, maybe it is a little bit stretch, you know, because it's ex, uh, 4 to 3 expand mode rather than widescreen, but I guess it's it's supposed to have those little border lines there. I thought, I thought it was... Uh, um, purely widescreen, but I, for some reason I didn't pay attention to that life bar down there, but that's okay, I didn't take much hits anyway, nor do you really need to see that anyway, because you'll know when I'm dead, because I'll die, probably somewhere along there, so this is Hot Rush, RUN, because these blocks are exploding behind you, holy cow, can this, can the camera actually pick up on these blocks, I don't know, this is like a really big fluorescent screen, I think it's doing an okay job of it, by the way, if you want to get the gold gem, you gotta go back, and then, um, ah, go away, out of my way, go away. <laughs> and then, uh, um, you have to go shake that ball, and then I'm pretty sure the gem appe oh, appears. Run! Go! Go! Don't bother with the freaking clan balls. <laughs> clan balls make you go slower. Go, 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 and there, there we go. <laughs> yeah, it's basically a race to the finish. And uh, if you screw up, I'm pretty sure you have to redo the whole level each time, so that went pretty well. Siren Swing is the next one. Work, 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 I need a short break. You think it's meaningless, but it's really refreshing. Swinging like this? Yeah. Be careful, if you hold still, you're going to sink. Ah, uh, it's so relaxing to not have to think about a thing. This feels great. What? You want to help across? Grab on and swing with us, but remember, we can't hold you long. Yeah, so basically grab on. Oh yeah, look at the screen. It really went into widescreen now. Or I mean, it's, it's, I mean, it went to a different dimension, so it is supposed to do that. What was I thinking when I adjusted that? Well, it, it works. Ah, oh, right in the lava. <laughs> Yeah, you don't die when you fall in the lava, but you lose a good amount of health and you restart from the last invisible checkpoint, which you can't really tell where the checkpoints are in the level until you've actually hit them and you die. So, yeah, just try, and, oh, try not to die. See, like, there was a checkpoint that I hit there and I didn't notice that I hit. And across and across, and over there is the gold gem, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, yeah, so, as I said, I'm not... 100%ing this game because all you do is get that extended ending movie thingy so yeah it's just more fun to beat the levels like this when you're playing on camera I don't know though I do like to explore things all right with this boss just grab onto his head slam him to the ground but you gotta grab him when he's charging at you and this B will be dead pretty quickly though it does get a little bit harder later on when he tries to grab onto you You'll see what I mean. It, when he tries to grab onto it, he it's like very, very hard. This isn't it. That wasn't the attack. It's very hard to dodge his grab attack. I don't know why. I don't even know if it is dodgeable, to be honest. Maybe you're supposed to button mash out of it or something. But, oh, he's dead. <laughs> I guess I didn't get to show the, the attack. <laughs> well, whatever. I escape from trouble, and I get to go to the next area. Yahoo! Woo! Yeah. Early game bosses are easy. <laughs> Maybe they'd be hard if I just first started playing this game, but I still don't know because you just gotta know to grab the enemies, you know? Yeah, and these are little coaster balls here. You gotta kinda grab your way through here and hopefully not fall into the lava on the way down. <laughs> so be careful. Because down is death! <laughs> I've been wanting to say that for a little while, and I'm pretty sure you have to switch sides so you don't... Whoa! whoa, whoa. Oh, okay. <laughs> I wasn't really paying attention there. Well, actually, I kind of was, but... Uh, I, I mean, I wasn't paying attention to Spiky Guy. Okay, you gotta go this way. Watch the, watch the uh, ang ways the ropes go. Like, down is the correct way there, and then there you go. Whoa, boy! Go away into the lava with you. <laughs> Whoa, no! No, 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 no! Whoa. Oh, I got lucky! I got so very lucky there. <laughs> I can't believe how lucky I got with that one. I should have been. I should have taken damage with that one. You seen that? I seen that. Uh, oh, everyone on YouTube seen that one. <laughs> I am getting extremely lucky. Whoa, whoa! Hey, hey, hey! No bad mouthing me. Go away. <laughs> I will use your body as a shield if I have to. Yes, you can actually do that. <laughs> 
And we have to jump from ball to ball here. Ball and oh why did I grab onto that ball? I should have grabbed onto the ball. I'm pretty sure I pressed the B button to grab onto that ball. <laughs> Boy, I certainly like the word ball, don't you? And I'm pretty sure I just dashed you up. There we go. I'm pretty sure higher is the gold gem. I could be wrong though, I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, but I don't know, I didn't really explore the levels for all the gems. Because this game is just too fun to be serious with it. Alright, free fall. And get ready to catch yourself. These are all spiky thorn guys. Now go to the left. Go to this and grab the stars, you're going down. Like this one. Grab it, grab it, okay. Now you gotta grab the star to your right here. And grab the star to your left from this side, like this. Now grab the star that you're coming up to in the middle. And there's the exit. Woohoo! That was the greatest puzzle ever. <laughs> Yeah, the idea is if you screw up, you have to start this level from the beginning because the warp star at the bottom of all those falls starts you right back up where those uh, chocolate covered blocks are. Those always remind me of like chocolate candy for some reason. They're, they're like really dark and chocolatey in color, so I guess that's why. Bye bye. <laughs> and you basically, over here, you gotta keep, ah, keep yourself from falling to your doom. I forgot you're supposed to switch platforms every once in a while, so I might as well uh, jump onto this red platform. When I get up, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Save myself a little time and get myself some energy. Yeah, the other platform goes right into the lava. I jump over the spiky guy. The controls are really fluent in this game, it, but at first they don't really feel like it. You'll see when you actually play this game, if you ever actually play this game, how fluent of the controls this game really has. Uh, can I go and angle this? No, I can't. Okay, I have to do a little boost over here and boing! Yeah! Okay, wait for it, wait for it, okay, <laughs> and there we go. Now you gotta keep the enemies off of this block here, because they will try to sink the platform into the lava. <laughs> this is a very creative part of the level here, one of the most creative parts in the game in my opinion, because you gotta keep this uh, platform clear of as many enemies as possible. And the enemies a little bit later, like these right here, will give you some trouble. <laughs> And, oh, they guard your shots, don't they? Bye-bye. You gotta go. So do you, and you. <laughs> yeah, and make sure that you keep jumping on the platform so it doesn't get close to the lava. Throw them off ASAP into the lava. Yeah. Simple as that. But uh, if you don't know what you're doing, you might not notice that your platform is sinking and you're gonna die. <laughs> And make sure to wait for this platform to come up, uh, below that uh, rainbow blue screen star, I should say. Because you sometimes can fall into the lava if you try and jump the gun. So, yeah, play it safe. Oh, seasick climb. This is a hard one. See how this, see how it rotates? Well, that actually affects the physics of the room. Like, when it's rotating this way, you can't boost as far as you can towards the direction that you want to. Like, watch how far I was able to boost there, and now wait until